What's up YouTube? It's your boy Bryson Cole and we about to get right into it. You feel me? And today we are gonna draw Travis Scott. Oh my god! So you know I had to go pick up some cacti. Uh Travis, this stuff is hard to find, man. Come on. But we're gonna try this out, you feel me? One hour later. It's not bad. It's agave spike seltzer. Um, a lot of people say they don't like it. Truly, I don't know. This is the lime one. It got 7% alcohol. It's pretty good. I rock with it. You know, do not drink if you are not 21, kids. I don't condone that. All right. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up our Procreate canvas. If you don't have Procreate, go get an iPad, you Neanderthal. Who? If you don't have Procreate, please get a pencil, paper, whatever. Also, I'm probably gonna do a giveaway, a Wacom tablet. This thing is awesome to draw with. Uh, if you want to win a Wacom tablet, comment down below how much you love the channel and subscribe and get your friends to subscribe. What are you doing? Come on. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, Travis. It's lit. <laughs> All right, now what we're gonna do is open up Procreate. We're gonna have our canvas 3000 by 3000 with 300 DPI. You know what we have to do. We have to go and find an image. We're gonna do Travis Scott. So we're gonna go to images. I'm gonna pick this one. You're going to add the photo, so you're gonna save it because a cool thing about Procreate is when you open it up, you can go to the wrench tool and then click on canvas, click reference, and you can add an image from your photo library. It's freaking perfect. First thing I like to do when I sketch out my cartoons, since you are gonna draw Travis Scott in BC graphic style, is we make a pencil. We, we make a circle, I'm sorry. It is like one in the morning, forgive me. All right, so first thing I like to do whoop, is actually pick black, and I have a sketch pencil tool. A lot of y'all are asking for these pens. I need to find a way that I can just export these and give them to y'all because I'm not a man of secrets. I want y'all to be able to draw whatever. So I have no problem in sharing the love. You feel me? So first thing we're gonna do is draw that circle. You feel me? We're gonna have his chin down here. You're gonna pick where you want your chin. Go to the edges, go down a little bit and start curving towards that point we made, that line we made. Now we're gonna uh, we're gonna add a line down the middle, and the next thing I like to do is add a line down the uh, middle horizontally. So you kind of pick where you think the line is, and then you're gonna half that. So now we just split up in two pieces, and we're gonna half the next piece. That's where his nose is gonna go. Now we're about to half that. Bam, bam, wham! They're all half. Okay, Jiggy Juice Tom. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get his little, his little neck. And um, he's gonna be wearing this black shirt. So let's make it like a half circle. And for this one, it's gonna be really simple. I like to, I like to make like the collars on shirts for my cartoons like really thick. I don't know why. So, let's give him some shoulders. to make hey guys and if you just found this channel make sure you also sub and like of course but follow me on Instagram and follow me on TikTok. all my handles are BC graphics so make sure y'all follow me on those sites uh, it really helps me out and it really you know boost boost the crowd I'm trying to make I'm trying to grow I want to make this an empire I want to take over the world with my cartoons you feel me All right, now that we got his sleeves, I'm just gonna draw him some arms. And then we're gonna accentuate the shadows. Bam, we got our Travis Scott. He's looking beautiful. So next thing we need to do is get back to mapping out our face. Um, right here is where I really like to do the eyes. So I'll make his eyes more round for this one for whatever reason. All right, and we're just gonna focus on one eye because once we have this eye, we're gonna copy and paste it. Why do extra work, guys? Come on. So inside, we're going to make his eye, his iris, and then on the sides, we fill it in. 
Bam, that looks beautiful. Look at Travi. Look at Travi. Over here, we're gonna make another kind of eyelid thing, basically. I'm going to copy this. I'm gonna use the freehand lasso tool. We're gonna click copy and paste, and we're gonna flip it horizontally, and it just flipped the whole freaking thing. Like, what is going on right now? Copy, paste, and we're gonna flip it horizontally. So now we have Travis Scott's other eye. Bam. Now, there's something wrong with this. We have the pupils looking opposite ways, meaning the light is coming from different ways. So Travis Scott's like cross-eyed right now. Circle one of the pupils, hold it, and flip it horizontally. So we're gonna flip it back. So this is a little wonky. What we're gonna do is rotate his eyes so it doesn't look like this. All right, we're gonna give him some eyebrows because I don't really want him looking like all spooked. And then we're gonna give him a smile. We'll do the teeth at the top, we're gonna kind of curve it. And then below we're gonna have just a hump for his tongue. Perfect. Now, where the two top lines that we made for the reference, we're gonna put his ears right there. So, let's draw his ears in. And as you can see, I don't know what shape that is for the ears, but that's kind of how I do my ears. What is that? Uh, this one could be a little bit better. Next, we're gonna give Travi a hairline. So, you kind of go up to where you think his hairline will be. I'm gonna say it's right here. We're gonna come down, make an indention. Give him a little sideburn, you feel me? Get trappy them sideburns. Boom. Looks good. And then we're gonna clean up some of this line work. That way we can see what's going on. Bam. All right, so now we're gonna do the inside of the ears. When I do the inside of the ears, I kind of make it look like an elongated E. So we start off with a curve. We go in, curve it out, curve it in. Oh, shoot, I mean, yeah. then we kind of go up. And then on the bottom, I always like kind of color in a piece of the E. And on the top, I make a half circle. Does it look like Travis Scott that? No, because we need the Travis Scott braid. It's lit! So, let's make a new layer and do the braids on a different layer. Cause I don't want it to mess up how he's looking. I'm basically gonna just make a squiggly going down. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make kind of like a zigzag down to his hairline. All right, so what Travis Scott does have is like arrow tattoo that goes on the top, so I'm trying to find what that looks like. We got Travis Scott tattoo on his face, on his forehead. And now we need to kind of make a lump for his other braids. So we want one set of braids to come behind him. Bet, bam, that is our Travis Scott. Um, I'm gonna add a few more details, like a little bit of chin hair. I'm probably gonna add huh, some necklaces on him. And then I think that'll I think that'll be our Travis Scott. <laughs> I like it. So next part, you know, we got to ink it. All right, bam. My boys, Travis is looking good. Uh, next thing we're gonna do is the shading. Okay, a fun thing you can do now before we shade is uh, add texture to things. So we're gonna go to the hair and uh, I'm gonna look at different art brushes and I'm gonna go to the texture brush and I'm gonna make the color a little darker and we're just gonna add texture to it. All right guys, so our Travis Scott is basically done. The last thing I really like to do is add a little uh, bling flare to him and a background. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna look for the luminescent. We're gonna go to flare. Whoa, that's way too big. 
That's what she said. <laughs> I'm basically going to add it to each diamond on him. And what I'm going to do is do it to his necklace too. So you kind of just add them every you want. And bam, you have completed your Travis Scott drawing. I really hope you guys enjoy this one. I'm going to leave a link so that you can download this if you uh, want to keep it or make a wallpaper or whatever. Um, I appreciate y'all. I thank y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend about this channel so we can grow as a community. And I appreciate you guys so much. God bless, and I will see you next time.